Hello, my loves. So yesterday, let me go back, actually. <coughs> and my fire sign, yes, look, for my fire sign masculines, a deceased parent. They can steal the recipe, but they can't steal the sauce. A Jezebel spirit here, right? So the Jezebel is going back to the California girl that I mentioned or possibly mentioned the other day. And that's what they were talking about. Um, let me see. The girls that are up there in Cali. Yeah. Cali girls. And then Mafia, he was talking about how some people, um, were following him and they were talking about some gang shit. He don't know exactly what it was. So definitely some, some type of, also, um, with the PNG, PNB, what is it? Yeah, PNB artist. It came out in my fire sign reading that a man was passing away. So it's like it's been leading up to it. But it didn't click that I was saying, you know, that a man is going to be passing, you know, um, and then with him, it says that his father died when he was three years old. Fire sign reading, it's mentioned a deceased parent. Biting off more than you can chew. They was inside of a restaurant here. And I was talking about protecting yourself whenever you go out, bruh. And it was artists. If I'm not mistaken, artists fell out as well. PNB artist, the dude is a artist. And it was 90s baby fell out. So he was born in 91 and at 30, someone in their 30s also fell out. I seen necklace, but I don't believe that I said anything about a necklace. Maybe I did, but I don't remember. They trying to take his necklace. They trying to steal his drip, his sauce. Okay, so that make like so much sense here. Yeah. <clears throat> Man passing, that fell out also in the earth sign reading. No, the earth sign reading is where the man passing fell out. And that was the mystery that I was solving. I was talking about the Yolanda Brown. But I've also been, it's kind of been leading up to this as well. Graveyard magic. I said that they were trying to fucking kill somebody. And I said that something was going to be in the media. So y'all definitely like pay attention to the shit that I be saying. I may not say like exactly what it is, but the shit that I be putting out there, like the shit that come out on the table, it definitely it's very significant. Okay, so I'm going to finish up my readings with my female fire signs. You guys are the last ones.
I hope that all is well with you guys. Sorry, I had to start that little intro off like that for your video. But I definitely wanted to get that out there. Just this even more clarification. If anybody ever doubt me, motherfucker, go doubt yourself. Okay. All right, female fire signs. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. That's better. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, females. What is going on for my babies? Oh, it's way too fucking many. Okay. A flute could be very significant. Not only that, but I actually heard someone. It sounded like they were playing a flute outside not too long ago. So a flute could be very significant for someone. Maybe you played it. Maybe you like the sounds of it. Maybe you should listen to those frequencies. I don't know. Let's see. I can see what your children are doing, child is doing, and band. To be significant to your culture. However, female fire signs was good. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. I bless and appreciate every religion. Okay. There is something for everyone in this magnificent environment of why diversity where we as a people can continue to take thought beyond that which have not been done before. Okay. Respecting other people's culture, um, respecting other people's belief. Understanding that there's a wide variety, there's diversity. Um, I know this is very true because with my mother, she is a Sagittarius. And with our family events, it is a wide variety of everything. Like there's gays, there's whites, there's black, there's Indian, there's literally, you know, there's any mixed there's every, a little bit of everything there. <laughs> okay. Any and all are welcome sort of shit. <laughs> okay, a helpful person. So you could be this helpful person or someone wants to help you. Think of who it may be and initiate contact. Okay. Someone wants to help you. So whatever this is, someone could be wanting to help you on. We're going to find out. This can be angelic help or actual help in the 3D. Okay, I'm going to take these two. Watch your thoughts. It is important to only think about what it is that you desire not what it is that you fear. That could be what you're needing to practice on, practice on keeping control over your thoughts. There's nothing for you to guard yourself against. You're existing in a place of absolute well-being. Tell yourself that over and over again. Know it, be the evidence of it, and give others a reason to believe that all can be well, that all diversities can coexist or that different you know diversity is okay you know whatever sort of thing 
It is not my work to control others. Trying to limit anybody about anything defines the law of the universe, and it cannot be done. You cannot control others, but you can control and create your own reality. So no longer trying to control anything, watching your thoughts, practicing being healthy, not being like too demanding or expecting. I don't know exactly what this is. Okay. Soulmate relationship. A new romance of a, of a spiritual basis is here for you now. Okay. A soulmate is someone that you you can really connect with. Someone that you can really bond with. You guys may share the same beliefs about a wide variety of religions and beliefs and you know that sort of thing and this person could be coming to give you some helpful information this could be a lover this could be a friend this could be someone again that is on the same frequency that's on the same vibrations as you but i'm really getting more so just controlling your thoughts okay what is the big hurry it is all for joy all is well you're not ever going to get it done so what are you racing towards every single activity that you're involved in is for one purpose only and that is to give you a moment of joy that's why it all exists lighten up laugh more appreciate more all is well yeah i feel like someone could be coming like someone is comforting for you that's what I'm instantly getting yeah okay today no matter where I'm going no matter what I am doing no matter who I'm doing it with it is my dominant intent to see that which I am wanting to see and that should be wanting to feel good wanting to be in positive energy and high vibrations yeah, a new dawn. The worst is now behind you. Positive new experiences are on the horizon for you. Okay, so practice happy thoughts. Even if something comes up and it's just like, ah, the worst thinking, like, no, 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 just bring it back. Tone it down some. Something, I'm getting those sorts of energies. Um, Also, like, find more things to appreciate. Okay, so, let me see. <clears throat> Female fire sign, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius. Yeah. What does my babies need to know? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, females. My divine feminine. Yeah, look, soulmates. So definitely something about your soulmate here. This could be pertaining to your soulmate, like have happier thoughts with your soulmate about your soulmate. If you guys are like wanting that, it's like focus on the good side, focus on, you know, what it is that you're wanting to manifest, exactly what it is that you're wanting to manifest on down to the smallest details. Your fingernails being clean. I mean, the smallest. <laughs> okay. We'll see. Female Sagittarius, Aries, and Leo.
You guys may like to eat red meat. You should stop. That is not good, especially if you are black. You guys could be seeing 333 at a gas station. Or just like maybe while you're going to a gas station, you could like see that on the back of someone's car. But I did see the gas at um, one of the local stores nearby was 333. So that could be definitely very significant. Okay, allow no others to trouble you. So again, nothing should trouble your mental, your physical, your day. Okay. A honey do list. So you guys may be <laughs> making a list of things that someone needs to do. Maybe like go put gas in the car. Okay. All right. Female fire signs. What's going on with my babies? What is going on for my female fire signs? Three, three, three. Yeah, cleansing away the old so that new can come in. An affirmation is I, walk, I wash away any energy that is not mine to carry. I release myself from the burden of the past. I am restored and recharged for this new dawn. So literally, like I said, watching your thoughts, like retraining yourself with this practice, continuously doing this. Okay. Yeah. Because somebody is mentally trapped and you're needing to unlock that by practicing good thoughts. Nothing is more painful than staying stuck somewhere that you don't belong. Okay, with a crybaby, someone could be a crybaby. Yeah, look, fire sign female, that's, we're here for it. Okay. Deliver the message and I will protect you as long as you deliver the word. Okay, prophets are hated. So that's it. That's exactly what I was just getting at in the at the beginning of this like if you don't believe me then fuck you you know i i was getting that type of energy it's like no matter what is going on around you like shit has to be done regardless okay yeah somebody is needing to mentally unlock because they have to move on they have to yeah, look, it says the path is clear, welcoming change. So there's definitely some change that's coming about. Out with the old, in with the new. So, yeah, for sure. Or... If this is not someone being a crybaby, this could be like someone needing to cry. Like literally cry. Like let that shit out. Whatever it is that you have to do like to cleanse this shit away. I feel like someone could be holding some shit in and they really need to cry. Honestly. Okay. So... Go ahead, get your cry out, and keep it pushing, is what I'm getting.
yeah see with this you gotta check in with yourself otherwise external influences will fuck with your mental it'll fuck with your energy they'll have you off track that's how you're allowing others to get to you is because you're not actually one within yourself okay yeah it's a go a green light so something you guys could be seeing it at a green light a gas station near a, a light Please remind me of who the fuck I am. I might have forgot for a second. But if anyone tried to control me, guide me to my truth so that I may stand in my own power with Archangel Ural. So definitely pray to Archangel Ural here. Someone could have an Apple product here. Yeah, so someone is not happy with the person that they're dealing with. They can feel like this person is a crybaby that they're dealing with. Okay, so I don't know. That could definitely be for somebody. <clears throat> if it's not someone being a crybaby here, then it is more so just someone needing to cry in order to cleanse their soul. It's cleansing. That allow you to release that the shit that's built in and pent up and you'll be able to be renewed here. Okay. Someone doesn't have a child. Maybe someone has a pet, but they don't have a child, or they just don't have either one, okay? Clearly, I don't give a rat's ass. So whoever this person is with an iPhone and without children, clearly don't give a fuck about something. About this honey-do list, maybe this person had a list of shit that they were supposed to do and they didn't do it. I don't know. Someone clearly doesn't give a fuck. Um, it's like they don't have any responsibilities. Yeah, they single, so they don't really have responsibilities. Yeah, because taking men are the reason why people like to be single and the women without children are so hype right now is because they don't have to go through the bullshit that married or that single mothers have to go through. So they're actually in line properly, but we were created to be fruitful. So I always think like, you know, we got to keep shit going. Great universal assistance is coming to help your vision. Okay. You're embarking upon something inspiring as well as exciting. Dance with grace. Happiness is just a beat away. So stay moving, stay in rhythm. Protecting yourself, protecting your energy. Someone has a child that has passed away. Your phone could be glitching. It could be some sort of malfunction. It could go dead. It could just randomly want to reset, um, update, you know, something like that.
you know, cry, dance, get it out. Um, yeah, something about someone's DNA and a false pastor is a karmic lesson to be learned. So someone could be like, there could be a, a shady pastor that could be doing some shit or saying some shit. I don't know. This could be someone in your family or something pertaining to DNA and a child passing. Okay. Um, if you guys have lost a child, then your child could be speaking to you prior to or shortly after the malfunction. So definitely pay attention. Correct a fool and he will hate you. But if you correct a man, then he will appreciate you. So if somebody is, okay, Aquarius rising. Ancestry check. Someone could be worried about their kids, but their phone is malfunctioning. Definitely something like I said, something with your aunt with your DNA, your your lineage here. So you guys maybe needing to tap into your lineage. Okay, 1930 and 1940 could be very significant. 1940, I can guarantee you. Okay, this says 1930. There you go. 1940. person could be non-committal tried to kick you while you were down but they don't get no love i will seek the truth even if it may be harsh and i will speak my truth there could be some jealousy some stripping husbands from homes Children from their parents, siblings battling, sobriety, moderation. So women, females and their moderation could be something. Someone could have been noncommittal and argue in order just to leave and cheat. But the only closure you get is knowing that you tried your best. And when someone show you the red flags that you pay attention to this shit the, the first time. If somebody constantly on the sex shit, then you will automatically know that because that's all they talk about. That's all they want. That's all they do. If you are a person of integrity, don't be easily swayed by the bullshit. Continue to be a leader. Continue to guide others. Someone's children could be in the 90s, 2000s. Mm. So I feel like you guys could have someone 
that is again just wanting to have sex and you're not happy with that um someone literally could hair could be falling out okay so Oh, let's see the child here. This could be your child, your grandchild. I don't know. Let's see. Okay, one. So, yeah, someone in the 90s. This would be the year you were born, the year your child was born. I don't know. Take it however. What's going on for my Leo, Aries, Sagittarius females? <clears throat> Okay, a swan. This person of integrity, being beautiful like a swan, being devoted and elegant. Okay. What else for my Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, females? All right, Capricorn. You guys could be dealing with a Capricorn. This is someone that is bondage with the devil here. I was just seeing the five of swords. So someone could be like fighting the devil. Like trying to break free from bondage. Or this is someone fighting with a Capricorn. Okay. Yeah, Capricorn. Unable to move on. So you guys could be dealing with a Capricorn. This is someone who is unable to move on here. Okay. What about this Capricorn unable to move on? So you could already know about this fighting with this person. Yeah, look, I just seen the five of wands. This is the seven of wands, but I just seen the five of wands as well. Someone's discovering something about a car or discovering something about a cancer. releasing pain okay so this capricorn is unable to move on and they need to release this pain someone needs to get control over themselves female fire signs okay someone could be dealing with an aries I just threw it right on top of this 1930s and 1940s unintentionally. So you guys could be dealing with an Aries here. That could be the year they were born. Something pertaining to that time frame could be very significant. An Aries could be sending you a message. Or you're needing to send this Aries a message. Something about a new beginning with an Aries. I don't know. Let's see what's going on here for my Aries females. Recovering. So Aries, you guys are the ones that could be recovering from some jealousy here. You're getting a message about a new beginning. You guys could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Cap yeah, this Capricorn masculine here. Regrets manipulating you. 
causing confusion and manipulation. Okay. So Aries, you guys could be getting a message from someone, maybe an apology. The 1930 or 1940 could be someone's address, phone number, you know, whatever. Yeah, see, act when necessary to renew this, to fix this, to heal this. Okay, so they are going to be reaching out to you. A Scorpio. What's going on with this shady pastor? Shady pastor. A lack of clarity and a lack of teamwork. Okay, so with this shady pastor, if someone is, has dealt with a shady pastor and they're unable to move on from that, from someone causing them a lack of confusion, a lack of clarity, you know, not really teaching them the right things here. That would go back to, you know, guiding the youth and telling the motherfucking truth. Okay, guiding the youth and telling the truth. I like that. Guiding the youth and telling the truth. I absolutely love that. Okay. Someone's intuition is blocked. They have high expectations. Or maybe someone's not listening to their intuition because they have high expectations. What is this? What is this high priestess in reverse here? Can we talk? So this Capricorn could be asked. I told you this Capricorn going to be reaching out. But you could be saying like, no, you don't. You don't want that maybe. Let's see. Balance your expectations. Balance your emotions. Like something here. Someone's married and depressed at the same damn time. Someone's married and feel left out in the cold. Buffalo, New York could be very significant. The Scorpio is toxic. Scorpio Pisces Cancer masculine is toxic as fuck. So y'all could be married to this person. And that motherfucker toxic as shit. <laughs> and it's like you don't want to fight with them. But they are a sick person so you have to take action. Okay, I don't know. What's going on with this fake, this shady pastor here? I get, I'm getting like listening to the pastor and not paying attention to your intuition. These people have high expectations and you're really supposed to be in balance within yourself. And going, taking action towards what make you happy, not fighting with people who are mentally sick and who are toxic, who are narcissists, who are low vibrating. So someone could be jealous of someone traveling and they feel left out here.
or this is someone jealous and they're traveling to cause someone to be abandoned. I don't know. Or abandoning someone if you travel, so don't go. I don't know. Okay, so if a Sagittarius is bringing you a love offer here, like it's taking action, someone could be jealous of that. Someone could be taking action to travel. I don't know. This abandoning and travel is sticking out to me. So... Independence and freedom. It, it says horse and she's literally on her. So someone was jealous and they took action towards something. Okay. Towards Virgo Capricorn masculine here. I feel like if you guys travel somewhere, then you could be getting stuck. You guys could be dealing with a Virgo because this Virgo is here. So you guys could have been dealing with someone that had that you had high expectations for, but they were toxic as fuck. It could have been. A Virgo passing. The way to grow is with new love. That's the truth or this um, Gemini Libra Aquarius masculine here. Could be traveling. Y'all could have like some shady yet. This could be like a traveling pastor. Yeah, there's some deception here with a with someone being gay or with a young boy. Deceiving the kids, but that's even going back to deceiving the kids. This contract is unbreakable. There could be someone in your family that's feeling lonely. It's Virgo. That's carrying a burden here. Or somebody that like got all the money is low-key lonely as fuck carrying the burdens. If you are feeling this way, then you're needing to introspect. Definitely let it out. Let it out. Okay. Yeah. Queen of Wands, Clever, Harmony, Sensitivity, and Love. 
Yeah, sensitive. Maybe with your soulmate or sensitive about this pastor situation here. I don't know. Um, that's the Ten of Wands again. So something is definitely a burden. The Empress taking action. This could be someone's mother taking action. Or this is someone taking action to become the Empress. Pisces, Leo. Worried about a serious commitment. Worried about their focus. And standing up for themselves. This, um, someone's child could be a Leo Pisces that someone could be worried about. They are protected. They are growing and they are okay. They very well could have been disappointed by someone. This very well could have been you. This could be an outsider. It has caused an imbalance with a Leo, but it is absolutely okay. Someone is stalking someone after leaving them out in a cold here. But that shit's not going to go as expected. Whoever this greedy person is, this woman that's greedy, whatever you're thinking about this person, it is true. Okay? They're unable to get away with whatever this is that they're trying to And I said somebody is like feeling abandoned here. So it's like they left you, but then they watched after, you know, it, it's something like that. Someone reuniting with their family. Walking away from someone ruthless here. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, female. That could be someone that's a part of your family. Okay. See what I can get out of here. I'm definitely getting some lineage things going on here. So someone could be like recovering their bloodline, breaking generational curses here. Okay. So next, 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 next. The table so first. Cuss babies, you guys are included in my readings as well. So if there's any cusp energy out here. Only accept whatever parts of the message that resonates, okay? Do not force it.
All right, let's take these few. Okay, the beach. I said somebody was fucking like traveling somewhere. I just said that. I'm getting something about the way women are dressing, something about also your DNA, your bloodline, checking into your ancestries. Again, you are not supposed to eat red meat. <clears throat> Okay, someone is again not happy with the person that they're dealing with. Maybe if you're not having sex with them, then they'll start arguing in order to go somewhere else here. Maybe some of you guys are tapping in with your soulmate here. You guys could be going to the beach. Okay, there could have been delays prior to and now you guys are able to. A new dawn. This is what makes me think, you know, there could have been some situations and now you guys are able to, or you guys already have something like that, okay? You have a tribe to lead, clarifying this shit all over again. Like literally, someone has a whole entire tribe to lead. Can't stop, won't stop, let's get it. <laughs> A plug. Okay, so something about a plug is very significant. Somebody can have a plug on like beach houses. Okay, if you're asking for affection, then be sure that your partner has your attention. So, yeah, I definitely feel like somebody ain't, they ain't satisfied here. Okay, that could be for some of you guys. I'm not going to say every single one of them. You know, that's just for some. What? Shut the fuck up. Your boyfriend or your girlfriend is cheating. So, again, somebody is not satisfied here. My husband will love and honor and respect our union. So for those of you that are single, those of you that are dating, those that are married, there's a message for all of you guys here. You just have to take it, however it resonates, okay? Your home is a pleasant place for which you will draw happiness. Okay, so you guys could like have parties at your home. You guys could just be comfortable at your home. You guys could be a homebody. You know, you don't like to be out around other people doing other shit. You know, unless it's the beach. It's the type of vibes that I'm getting in my type of gal. Okay, someone has a foot tattoo. Someone in your circle has crossed you. Again, out of pure jealousy. I am a giver learning to give to myself. So if you guys are always constantly forever giving to other people, learn how to give to yourself. Learn how to do what makes you happy. I pray that you find peace in the middle of your storm, in which I feel is also about to be over if it is not over yet. Okay, busted. Someone is busted for some shit that they've done. Whoever this is that crossed you, they're busted. A very important day. Okay, so there is a one day in particular that is very significant. Okay, someone could be spending too much money.
okay this week something very significant this week someone could be getting busted the plug could be getting damn i didn't see that the plug could be getting busted this week somebody could be going to the beach this week someone could be spending too much money this week someone is girlfriend or boyfriend is going to get busted for cheating you have to take the messages however it resonates guys if you're this giver and you're learning to give to yourself this week is the week for you to give to yourself if that means to say fuck everybody and go to the beach then you do just that if you want to go and fucking wild out get a foot tattoo dye your hair cut your hair do some crazy shit fucking do that i guess don't spend too much money <laughs> but wild out goddamn <laughs> Your psychic skills are enhancing for those of you that have psychic skills. Okay, blood type AB. I want to say this is water. I always mix the two up, water or air. I would like to say this is air, but I'm seeing a lot of water in this reading, so I'm not sure. But someone who has the blood type AB. There could be some DNA found of someone who has this blood type. And that is how someone is going to be busted. This could be significant with someone who has a foot tattoo. If this is like some sort of crime, somebody is literally, that's it, okay? Whatever and however. There could be a pastor that is spending too much money they're spending too much of the church's money okay um on the wrong things you know you guys gotta literally take it however it applies but make sure you're releasing that pain and you're keeping your energy you're finding comfort yeah look the justice card so things are going to be brought to a balance. Yeah, so put time and energy into yourself. Put the efforts into yourself is what I'm hearing. Possibly in order to help your psychic skills enhance. Somebody could be running from a Leo or you're needing to run from this Leo or a Leo is running. Take it however. Okay. There could be a Leo on the run because some DNA was found. Shut the fuck up because some DNA was found from someone's death. Scorpio energy. Looking at things from a new perspective. So someone could be locked up because of some DNA being found. Taurus, outside influences. This is your soulmate. And then serious commitment. I don't know. So if y'all are worried about like someone's, maybe someone has passed away and you're like worried about trying to get justice here, then I feel like somebody is definitely going to be getting justice served. Yeah, what I told you. Overcoming trials and tribulations, peace, purity, courage, staying level headed, be humble. This was a lot more than I was expecting, guys, but I feel perfectly fine. Because I made you guys wait, I'll make your video the longest. 
What's going on, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, females? Yeah, spending time with your friends, moving on, um, receiving what it is that you need. If there was some closure issues, again, someone's going to be calling you. Trying to fix this. Yeah, be level-headed. Focus on yourself. Self-love. That is going to help you overcome your trials and your tribulations here. I want to see who the fuck this pastor is, but... Honestly, yeah, again, self-love, running and focusing on your self-love, separation, heartbreak, grieving, mourning, breaking up and engagement. So you guys could have ran away from someone that you guys were engaged to. You could have called the engagement off. <clears throat> Okay, Queen of Wands, protecting themselves, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, protecting themselves, unable to move on from the bondage and manipulation here, and that's what someone is discovering. This could be someone in your family that you're working with that is depressed and carrying burdens as well as lonely okay there is definitely some manipulation there could be this capricorn here capricorn masculine as you can see not on the right side of the energy and this could be what it is that you are discovering Someone could work with a Virgo or someone's needing to work with their higher ups, with their angels to help them fight this depression. So if y'all are depressed, remember you are too blessed to be depressed, baby. Keep it going. Keep it going. Keep it going. Yeah, grow. Make that your actual goal is to continue to grow. And yeah, that's the exact energy I was getting. Okay, so I'm going to leave it here. I love you guys. Peace.